On 26 September 1991, the University of Arizona opened the 3.4 acres of science research facility they called Biosphere 2, located in Oracle, Arizona. One of the things that scientists were studying in this institute is the life of plants, so a huge glass dome was constructed to house an artificial, controlled environment with purified air and water, healthy soil and filtered light. The intent was to afford perfect growing conditions for trees, fruits and vegetables, as well as humans and everything that seemed to do well, until scientists discovered that when the trees grew to a certain height, they would topple over. It baffled scientists until they realized they forgot to include the natural element of wind into its controlled environment. So here's the thing, even though the wind and storm seem like a bad thing for trees, trees that grow in an environment where the wind is absent, dies. That's why Michelle Obama said, It's important for you to understand that your experience facing and overcoming adversity is one of your biggest advantages. Think about the story of trees I told you earlier. The wind seems like what causes trouble for trees, yet trees that are planted in a place where there is no wind don't grow healthy. That exactly is what your life looks like. Your life needs troubles to grow and blossom. Let me repeat, your life needs troubles to grow. You need the courage to go through obstacles or else you would never be strong. It's important for you to understand that your existence facing and overcoming adversity is one of your biggest advantages. Born two months premature, on February 20, 1927, Sidney L. Poitier was not expected to survive, but he fortunately survived. Coming from a poor family in his teenage years, Poitier resulted in several odd jobs to make a living, including dishwashing at age 16. Soon after then, Poitier joined the American Negro Theater, but was rejected by audiences because he wasn't able to sing and because of his terrible accent. To overcome this obstacle, Sidney L. Poitier spent the next six months to practice and become a better actor, and then he tried again, this time with a better approval rate. Poitier went from there, overcoming every single obstacle on his way with hard work, dedication, and determination to succeed, till he became the first actor to win the Academy Award for Best Actor in 1964. Like Sidney L. Poitier, every single person you know who achieved success today had to go through hell to do it. It's important for you to understand that your experience facing and overcoming adversity is one of your biggest advantages. Think about your life the way you think about human bodies. The strongest bodies in the world are those who have been subjected to painful exercise and labor. The weakest bodies in the world are those who go through little or no pain. So it is about your life. If you truly desire success, the only path to get it is the path of horror. You must be strong enough to face your fear. You must be determined enough to endure the pains on the road. You must understand that you will never get the crown except you carry the cross. It's important for you to understand that your experience facing and overcoming adversity is one of your biggest advantages. Robert A. Schiller said, Good things are often birthed from adversity. Every great invention that changed our world Every human who did something extraordinary, every unbelievable accomplishment, all of this came only because someone was willing to face their fears and endure the tough times. Lou Holt said, Show me someone who has done something worthwhile and I'll show you someone who has overcome adversity. The reason why most young people in our world today don't achieve any meaningful success is that our society trains them to avoid pain and adversity. Joseph B. Whitlin said, As with the butterfly, Adversity is necessary to build character in people. Think about what the wind does for the tree. It blows and causes it pains, but the wind also makes trees strong and able to grow. That exactly is how you must see obstacles and adversity. It's important for you to understand that your experience facing and overcoming adversity is one of your biggest advantages. Thanks for watching. My name is Steve Courage. I'm a Nigerian entrepreneur and you can join my channel right here on the screen or at the description below. I love you.